We had a very strange event last night. What we were seeing was a change in the pattern of the harmonic tremors. Let me just explain first. The blue lines show tectonic earthquake. These are due to the movements of the fault lines. And volcanic earthquakes, so magma ones, are the purple one. These are the rising and boiling of magma. When the boil uh, happens in the magma, it practically releases the gas, depressurizes, releasing the gas and rising, like a milk which is too hot. Uh, what we had here, movement of the fault lines, created a void, then the magma rising to fill up the void. And what we see in the uh, tremors chart of the Grindavik area is that we have a rise in the tectonic tremors, the blue line, and with that we have a fall in the magmatic tremors. That means the um, initially the magma starts to fall down, then boils because the pressure is being removed by the relieving of the fault lines, it rises back again. It means boiling is happening in the magma. We see that in the uh, earthquake charts is moving in front of our hours, eyes. We can see that. And this seal from the Grindavik and the sea toward the Swartzengi uh, power plant, Blue Lagoon practically, or Black Meadow, is happening in front of our, the magma is moving due to the extension of the fault lines. I'll show you this on the map that I positioned all the earthquakes by my colleague is done in the um, uh, Icelandic Meteorological Office. You can see the pattern. The pattern is like an S-shaped. This pattern shows to me that there is a, a fault line here, a market, and extended to the Clare Far uh, Watt area. We had a cluster of earthquake there also. This earthquake shows that the fault line was active, pulling apart uh, and opening up, and then higher after the uh, Swartzengi, we have a transform fault transferring this movement, accommodating it into the clear forward in the area of that uh, you know, glacial lake that we have, three kilometers to the west of it. And this is the pattern we know for the Mid-Atlantic Ridge and all the Mid-Oceanic uh, mid Ridges. They have a extension, then transform fault in the... Uh, a few you know, kilometers distances. And that's the pattern we see, the reversal of, this is the way actually we discovered the continents are moving with, by observing this reversal of the polarity. Here we can see that boiling of the magma happened in front of our eye. We could see through the earth with the knowledge. Now you know that how it happened. This is clearly, we can see it. We don't have the eye to look through the rock. But this chart shows us the movement the spatial movement and the temporal movement to the time, we can see that. This is amazing. Geophysics is amazing.